What's up, everyone? It's Jonathan Bay Area Throwbacks. Um, back with the Ava School Flannels that I did not expect because I have three, currently had three before this came, on the way, or that I ordered. Um, well, two were actually, there were some errors, so I had to send back and get them. So I'm waiting for those two. And then a new one I had ordered for the Black Friday sale. Um, and the only update I got was yesterday that one was on its way. And I've never had one come within a day. So I don't even think it's that one. So I don't know if maybe they uh, forgot to give me an update about one of the other two. So I have no idea what's in it. But it's one of three jerseys. So I'm excited. <clears throat> Birmingham Black Bears, Negro Leagues. The Giants games, they used to have um, a stand there with the, I think it's the big boy gear or whatever. Uh, Negro League stand where they sell like Negro League uh, gear and they have like these style shirts and I chose Black Barons just because I was Willie Mays's Negro League team before he um, was on the Giants and if I'm not mistaken he was like 15 uh, when he was playing the Killing It oh, this is much on the all right let's see I was not expecting this at all. I guess I have no idea which one's in here. Oh, thank you. My Joe DiMaggio. This is my second Ebbets Field Joe DiMaggio jersey. Damn. Let's see. Okay, so this is a. Oh, yeah. Let me hide that. Yeah, it's my 1933 home. I have uh, Joe DiMaggio. So, I'm not really into too much of the Joe DiMaggio just because I've already done two Joe DiMaggio videos. This will be my third one. So, I've already kind of in those two explained about him. So, I'm not going to go there. I'll put the link in the description for those two if you want to know about his history. But either way, started his pro career off with the San Francisco Seals. Bay Area guy, of course, became, became, uh, before, you know, becoming a Yankees legend. But anyways, so I'd already received this jersey, yet, if you see here, they have the big S with the EA, um, and then the LS. They had sent me one where it was S, big S, but it said S-E-A-L. So it basically said S seal instead of S eels. So you know what I mean? So... I noticed it. I thought I was tripping for a minute. Can I have a book with seals uh, pictures? And when I looked at the book, I was like, no, this is the way it's supposed to be like this. And I looked at online. It was like this. I looked at Throwback Kings video who has the same jersey. It's like this. So I'm like, okay, they, they messed up. So I sent it to them, but they're super, always super helpful. Um, and this came literally weeks later. I've never had an Evans Field come this fast. So I'm assuming the guy said he was going to look at they already had one made. And I'm assuming maybe that's what happened. They had one already made. Either that or it was an easy fix or maybe they just uh, had to switch the lettering. But either way, I was not expecting this yet. So this is that. So now we will uh, get into the jersey. All right, we start from the bottom. Uh, something I like about, which I brought up in other videos about Ebbets, um, is with the flannels, they don't have a jock tag down here, which I honestly like because it just feels like you're actually wearing, you know, it's, it feels like, just like a jersey from back in the day is not no not an old school looking jersey with a new jock tag. So I honestly like that they don't have that. So that's the bottom. You got the white um buttons. I like how uh, you got the what do you call it? The pinstripes where it's not solid. Um if you look at the old jerseys from what I've seen, this is kind of like what it looks like. It wasn't just super solid, so I like how they Really pay attention to detail on those kind, of, kind, kind on those type of things. My bad, I'm tripping around on those type of things. So, there yeah, you come up. The piping starts here, which uh, the old pictures I've seen that matches up. You got double piping once you get up here. Let me take this. So, yeah, so you got the double piping. You got the seals here with the felt. Got that big S, S, E A L S seals. So I love that uh, that logo. Then you come, you got the sleeves. It has a little like armpit area right there. 
Jersey's nice and thick. You got your double piping on the sleeve, on the bottom. Come up here, you got the uh, Ebbets tag there. You got the uh, large, uh, genuine wool, made in USA. The usual um, Ebbets Field ticket that, they have, that it comes with, same old. Um, this one is different than the other uh, two I have shown before, the Sea Lions and my other uh, seals, where it has that extra, um, instead of it just being, this being the end of, the, of it, it has this extra piece here. Personally, to be honest, I'm not a fan of it, but I mean, that's how the jersey was, so I expect it to come like that, and I'm fine with it. I still love the jersey, but that's, um, you know, some of the older jerseys, they did have this extra, almost like a, not a turtleneck, but I don't know, a little extra, I guess, warmth for the back of the neck and the front of the neck and all that. So that's the front of the jersey, back. Same thing, you got the double piping on the back. You got this nice extra... You see here, this is it right there. And then you got your felt number 10, same O. That 10 that DiMaggio wore in 90, uh, not 93, 1933. And now let's throw it on. So this is the jersey on me. It's a large, it fits great. Um, Sleeves a little big, but that's how they're supposed to be because uh, it's kind of accurate to the times. Let me straighten this up. Yeah, just accurate to the times, you know. They used to have long, big sleeves, so that's what it is. So this is the large. Uh, this is my first one that has, like, the extra um, little, I don't know what you call this piece. If someone knows. You can let me know in the comments, but it has that. But either way, uh, yeah, so it fits great. I'm happy with my purchase. And pretty much that's it, 1933. San Francisco Seals home, uh, Joe DiMaggio jersey. So uh, if you haven't checked out Ebbets, I would check it out. Ebbets uh, Field Flannels. I'm gonna have more, I have some more on the way coming. Um, I, got, I got two more that I can think of right now. They got great uh, prices. They have sales all the time. So check them out, honestly. They got some great stuff. So that's that. Um, if you like the video, like it. If not, it's all good. Uh, if you like the content, subscribe. If you're already subscribed, thanks for being here again. I'll see you next time. Have a good day, everybody.